My official title is communications director to this incredibly difficult doctor. No matter how hard I work, it's just never good enough for him. He's my dad. So. Oh. I talk a lot when I'm nervous because you are the hottest guy that I've ever matched with and I do this a lot. Not a lot, I mean like a normal, healthy amount of a lot. I will fight. I've seen my dad turn countless women's despair into joy and hope. I will fight for you. In order for the miracle of conception to occur, one sperm must win the race for life against 250 million competitors. So I made it my mission to improve nature's odds, to combat infertility. Excuse me, sir. My source alleges that you use your own sperm to impregnate a woman at the Beckley Clinic. As soon as he gets the recognition he deserves, the crazies come out of the way. Oh, 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 Dad! For patients of the Beckley Clinic, the whole story of how they came to be could turn out to be a lie. Patients are taking matters into their own hands so they can find out the truth. You okay? That's just a little more truth than I was ready for. Did you know? Classic Leon. Leon Beckley, Julia's father. I grew up with them. I'm your mother. I carried you. I cared for you. That's what matters. When I started out, infertility was a dead-end street. I became the last resort for desperate patients. I stacked the deck. You did terrible harm. Something in the way you roll your eyes. Julia actually does the same exact tooth tapping thing. No, I don't. So does Edie. I do not tap my teeth. What if it's like a shared genetic trait? Like rolling your tongue into a cigar shape? But now you're the only thing that's good. Do you guys want to get a sister selfie? Me home in the dead of night. I don't know about you, but I've kind of wanted a sister my entire life. Somebody that gets me. Somebody that I can share with. There's so much wrong. If they take me down, it'll destroy you, too. I was always jealous of you. You had a dad who would come home and sit down with you at the dinner table. I spent my whole life looking for that. You're welcome to stay here as long as you need to. No one's ever been this nice to me. I'm going to need my own bathroom, though, with a tub. If I don't get my soak on once a day, I'm like, no bueno. I can't believe it's not just me anymore. I have sisters. There is so much